A fully established drought across Oklahoma as we dive into some of the driest months of the year. Heading into the dormant season, you know, the, the stage is already set and in, in some ways the damage has already been done. Oklahoma Forestry Services regularly looks at how much fuel for fires is growing in different locations around the state. This year, along the a broad swath, along the I-44 corridor, uh, we are seeing uh, above normal to exceptional fuel loading. The growing season resulted in an abundance of fuel in much of Oklahoma. It's hard to get above normal in the eastern part where it's very timber oriented, uh, but uh, especially you know central along that I-44 corridor into portions of northwest Oklahoma, we're seeing well above normal fuel loads. With the overall dryness in the fuels, we're just waiting on those those fire effective weather systems. So anytime we have a you know a dry a dry line intrusion followed by a, a dry cold front. While this doesn't pinpoint exactly where wildfires will be, it's important to know that these dry fuels could make fires harder to control if they do happen. 